didn't quite get him, but it was worth a shot. Kabi, you really thought I'd sell out my comrades? <laughs> Look up there. I don't trust Marley one bit. Having said that, I trust the comrades who fought at my side completely. <laughs> Roughly 300 local soldiers who also drank the spinal fluid. I counted about 500 free enemy troops in the area, but I didn't see any sign of six. I'm not sure, but I know this much. That power is the strongest weapon they've got, the ace up their sleeve. There must be some reason they haven't played it yet. So I'm guessing that there's still something keeping Aaron from using the Founder's ability. He's always had powers above and beyond what the beasts usually would. This might be the explanation. If it is, then Zeke's absence could be what's keeping Aaron from using the Founder's power. We have to prevent the two of them from making contact. Perfect. Nice shot, Commander McGath. Roger that. I don't like our odds in a straight fire fight with the beast. But sir... The trick we just pulled will only earn you one shot. Make it count, General. Could that have done it? Would you piss off already? General McGuff, you can't win now. This battle is over. Judging from their speed and heading, it seems likely that the airships are withdrawing to Marley. I guess once they saw the rumbling start, they panicked and decided to save themselves, leaving the rest of us for dead. Fair, but even with warning, what'll our forces be able to do? Is there any real hope? Can these Titans be stopped? <laughs> I never would have guessed that you would be this knowledgeable about Titans, Hanji. You know more than Marley's guys. I don't suppose you've laid eyes on the founding Titan yourself. You shouldn't ask such things. I'm a lady, remember? You really caught us off guard with the Liberio raid, Yelena. But we got a bigger surprise when we looked into your past. You were born and raised in a typical Marleyan family, but you wrote yourself a new life story when you met Zeke, one where you were from an annexed territory. As you grew disillusioned with Marley, the story got more elaborate. It evolved into a grand fantasy about saving the world with your prince. And in time, you hoped your fairy tale would find its way into the history books. Your commitment to the lie is honestly impressive. It's the harbor. The Jaegerists beat us there. They've captured it. They must have gotten one of the trains up and running. There are tons of soldiers posted all over the port in full anti-Titan gear. S slow down, Annie. If the hostages are killed, the rest of the plan falls apart. Right, Onion Capone? There's no way to make that happen. We have to wipe them out with a lightning strike, or else a survivor will destroy the boat and strand us here. Bad idea. First transformations never go well. Leave the fight to me. After I get you all onto the ship, I'll back up the others. Ah! Don't follow. I need to drop you all off on that ship. Commander, Falco's out there. Back off, Tam! Falco! <laughs> Falco! The enemy's retreating! Come out! <laughs> Things were looking pretty bleak back there. It's general now. <laughs>